Now we can keep all of our favorite apps at the ready in slide over to quickly view, make changes or update it over internet or drag and drop from another app screen. In this video, I cover the basic ways to use slide over and troubleshooting tips for slide over not working on your iPad. To move notes app in the slide over, swipe up to view dock and tap and hold on a note app and move to up over the Safari app and leave when notes app show in slide over the window. Here in my example, I am using Safari to read my blog post at this time I copied some contents to notes and it's easy after open notes app and slide over the app. Now to hide the slide over app from the iPad screen, swipe it towards to the iPad edge. That's easy and open just swipe from the right edge to reveal your last slide over app. Now I am moving another my favorite app into slide over apps. This is a music app. Just open dock and under the recently opened apps find the music icon. Tap on hold and move to app, lift until it's converting into slide over a window. Now you can switch between slide over apps using the bottom app bar. Swipe finger on the bottom bar to switch another app just like iOS. Remind that you can't move any app in the slide over directly from the dock, here I unable to put messages app in slide over, because it's not opened in the background. Once I open a message app on the iPad, I can do it as of earlier. And switch between other slide over apps as you watch in the video. Now, all slide over apps will open any time after lock and unlock the iPad or from home screen. And one important feature of slide over a window is, it is movable on the whole iPad screen. To move just touch the finger and move it to left or right when you need to see another part of iPad screen. To force close app and slide over the app, just like iPhone, move the bottom bar to upward center until all the apps show in app switcher screen. To force close app, swipe up on app. Another hidden feature moves your message app and slide over from the notification. Here I got my friend's notification, just tap and hold on notification and drag to app right edge, leave it when app convert into slide over windows. Now start messaging without close or stop existing work. Also, you can drag link directly from Safari browser to message text box, or image as well. Another example of mail app you can check in this video, here I open mail app in the side over the screen, and send the new mail very easily using drag and past into mail body. I use spotlight search and type mail to get mail app here, tap on it to open. Now mail app is in recently used apps on the dock. Just drag the mail app into slide over pane and start sending a new mail or read unread emails. Right now all the functionality of slide over is working fine on my iPad. But if allow multiple apps toggle is turned off, slide over doesn't work. First check it if your slide over not working on your iPad with iPados 13 or later iOS. Go to the settings app and tap on general. Next to general tap on multitasking and dock option. Next, to check allow multiple apps option is enabled.
open slide over app screen that you convert into split view. Here I open message app is slid over the screen from the dock. Tap and hold on slide over apps top drag icon and move it to iPad's right edge. Main app auto adjusts the screen. Also, you can customize the app size using the slider between app. Or also move split view apps into slide over. Hopefully, you like this new slide over feature and troubleshooting tips. Split View super useful for the iPad users who are working on two apps at once. Just like transfer links, media, or text directly between Mail and Notes app. To get more hidden features and how-to videos first to you, subscribe our channel and like this video.